Okay, hi guys. This is Tati's Nails. This is my channel. I have just started today. I'm going to be answering a couple questions. And this is kind of like the very first video. So I'm going to, this is my first time. So I'm going to, you know, touch bases with everything to see kind of where I should go with my next video or start. So for the people that do not know me from Instagram, um, I actually grow my nails. This hand is short, of course, because I'm also a nail technician. My name, my real name is Tatiana. Sorry, guys, I'm scrambling. I'm nervous. Um, my real name is Tatiana. I'm a nail technician. I've been doing it for three years. And last year, I actually fell in love with long natural nails. And it's a whole thing on Instagram about it. And um, my Instagram page is Tati's Nails XOXO. So um, if you guys want to jump over and look at that, I'll try to see if I could tag it. Because I'm also not too good at video editing. So I don't know how good this video will be. But um, now anyways, one hand is short for work. Another hand is long for, for fun. See, I got my, my business hand, my fun hand. But as you can see, I don't know. Uh, boom, baby. Yeah. So, I have started the... I started it last year. I grew my nails out. Um, it was almost a year and my pinky broke. So, I started over. Wow, I look like an angel with all this lighting. Okay. And I was about to go somewhere. I don't just sit in the house with my hat on. <laughs> so, I wanted to hurry up and make this. But, um... Yeah, so um, I fell in love with it last year. I tried it. My pinky nail broke. I'm back again. It's the second time. And um, yeah, so um, of course, you don't have to be rude. If you don't if think natural nails is pretty, just get off the fucking video. It's not that big of a deal. It really isn't. But um, let's do this thing. So I actually even have notes so I could keep up with everything. So um, how I fell in love with long nails. Well, you know what? I don't know. I just thought it was so different and unique because we pay so much money to have the length that we want. Why not try to get it ourselves? You know, like we all have different nails. Why not try to see how yours will grow if you give them a chance? Um, why I grew my nails? I guess kind of like the first answer I was tired of, you know, well, with me being a nail tech, I didn't hit, really have to pay. I was tired of doing them every two weeks because my nails grow like weeds. I would always have to fill in my, um, I would always have to get a fill in, always put tips on, cut the length. They would grow, have to repolish them because I love polishing different colors every day. It was getting to the point where I was just over it. So I thought, let me grow my nails. Um... And on top of that, my mother has nice nails. So I kind of was like, I wonder if my nails will kind of grow like hers. Let me see. And last year when I very first started it and it grew that long, that was actually a test run for me. I didn't even know I wanted to grow my nails. I was just like, okay, I'll grow them. And they grew that long. And um, you guys could see it uh, if you don't follow my nail page, on my nail page, the whole thing, the whole history of it. They grew way longer than I ever thought they would have um yeah so I'll put in it's my Instagram it just in case I don't know how to edit it in or put it in a description is t-a-t-i-s-n-a-i-l-s-x-o-x-o okay so that should be good um now what I do to grow them that's everyone's question of these bad boys and these are their natural shape. I do not reshape them. These are their natural... Okay, really, son? Okay. These are their natural shapes. Um, I don't do anything to them. I just don't. Because uh, that's what I was trying to tell people. But it's hard trying to comment on Instagram. And then it's a paragraph. It, I don't grow or I don't shape them because... If I do, they'll chip on me. So with people suggesting, oh, try square, try this, try, it's really hard for me to because if I change their natural shape, my nails will break. I have learned that from growing them out the first time. They will break on me if I change anything about them. Isn't that funny? Um, guys, I got some fur. I think it might be from my scar. So how? 
how do you grow nails? How do you grow your nails, Tati? What do you do? I'm not going to lie. Your diet has a big part, a humongous part to do with your nails. And with me being a nail tech, I'm not going to be a douchebag and not tell you guys what I do or how to grow them. I, I kind of feel like it defeats the purpose. Like, I'm a nail tech. You tell them how to, you know, like people want help. That's all I wanted when I first started. And there's some people that will help you and tell. And there's other people that are rude and they're just rude. But you met me and I'm going to tell you everything I find out that helps. You guys are going to know. So once again, diet. I drink a lot probably more water than a person should it's like i swim in water i don't know i drink a lot of water and i know you guys are like ah oh, you know some of you are like ah oh, tati i don't know about this <laughs> i'm telling you water is key water and bananas surprisingly now i'm not too sure if the banana thing is true but when i was first growing them i kind of had spots on my nail beds and you know i would I mean, of course, everybody gets spots. If you hit your nail bed too hard or if you damage them, you're going to get some spots. But um, my mom was like, eat some bananas. I don't know if that was true or not, but I have been. And it seems like ever since I have been, like, my nails look clear, pink, and beautiful. And um, bananas actually, I was going to say something else. Guys, I'm losing track. Don't judge me. Well, bananas are really good. Bananas and water. Um, I hate bananas, but I force myself to eat at least one a day. I cannot stand bananas. But, I mean, this time around, growing my nails, they look so much more healthier than last year. They look so much better. Um, anyways, next, I do my vinegar and water soak. I put a lot of water in my cuticle bowl. And then I put probably two two um two topfuls of the vinegar the apple cider vinegar i put it and i dunk it in kind of mix it up with my fingers soak it in there now the water is always warm i don't like my water being cold i do it for 15 minutes once a week after that i cut my cuticles and then i heat up some olive oil and put that on my nail once or put that on my nails and stuff once again 15 minutes every once a week i usually incorporate it both on the same day so i don't even get mixed up i do still cut my cuticles i know some people have told you not to or you need them this and that since i am a nail tech i'm gonna let you know it really does not make a difference now i do not cut them to where they're bleeding and stuff and um I just trim them to make them look neat. Um, so yeah, if you guys could see, I trim them to make them look very neat. I don't trim them to, you know, just be a jerk. I, I just don't like my cuticles growing over. Um, yes, so cuticle oil, you need. Guys, if you don't do anything else I have let you know, use cuticle oil 24-7. I don't care if it was 50 cent. As long as it's oil, you hydrate your cute Guys, oh my God, I wish I could put hydrate your cuticles. Please. That is one of the biggest things you guys have to do. If you don't listen to anything, drink water and just hydrate your cuticles. Um, they will thank you later. Um, and for people with yellowish nails where they're staining or you want them to look clear or nice. I've heard lemon. I've heard of lemon. What I did, um, Halloween just passed, right? So I was in fake blood. I was touching fake blood, doing all this. Got home, my nails were freaking stained. Nails were stained, I almost had a heart attack. So what I did, um, poured some hydrogen peroxide and some baking soda, mixed it up into a thick paste, put it under and on top of my nails, left it on, scrubbed, I'm talking about scrubbed the hell out of them, scrubbed them, and boom. Now, I mean, my nails already look like this, but they were stained. So, I'm not saying the lemon thing doesn't work, but I'm saying that worked for me, the hydrogen peroxide. It really, like, took off everything, so I, that was good. Um, since I'm already running on nine minutes, I'm going to end the video here. Next video. You, well, okay, I'm going to need you guys to comment some questions. Comment questions. Follow me on Instagram. 
Instagram followers, hello. Follow me on YouTube, subscribe. Everyone, please subscribe and view my video because next video I am going to help you on how to fix damaged nails. I just wanted to do a quick rundown to kind of see, you know, to feel exactly how this is going to go. Um, with this YouTube channel, I'm going to show you guys things that I make because I'm actually coming out with a natural care product line. Um, coming out with that soon. But I kind of wanted to get my YouTube started first. Oh, I feel like this is going over. I did not want to talk for this long. I'm sorry, guys. But I'm starting a, a natural care product line. And I just want to get this flowing for questions. I might need you guys' help with scents. You know, I'm going to be asking you guys a whole bunch of questions. Like, to, to just, I don't know, comment what you guys think will be good. What you will like to smell. What you will like to do. And the biggest questions I get is, how do I fix my nails from acrylics? Video two, I'll let you know. And it's good because I'm a nail tech, so I do know the best things, and I won't steer you wrong, you know? I'm not going to tell you to do any BS and damage your nails more or do, no. But what I can, a quick tip if you are, sorry, I got an Instagram notification. A quick tip if you are trying to fix your nails let go of enhancements no acrylic no nothing let go start new start fresh cut your nails breathe let them breathe start fresh um any enhancement is going to damage your nails oh i'm getting into it i'll let you guys know second video but subscribe to my channel thank you guys for watching <sighs> fingers crossed that this youtube channel is gonna work Thank you. Bye, guys.